This is The Lockpicking Lawyer, and what I have for you today is a card-operated padlock that was sent to me by Randy in Detroit. The brand appears to be Operator Time, but it seems to be nearly identical to this Craftix card lock that I featured in video 529. I try not to be too repetitive, but these locks are so much fun that I decided to feature it anyway. You see, rather than a traditional key, this lock opens by sliding a card into this slot on the side. You put it in, give it a firm shove, and it pops right open. The holes that you see in the corner of the card interface with four dimple pins on a sliding carriage on the inside, and that's what ensures that only the correct card works. In fact, if I were to use this card from that Craftix lock, you would see that nothing happens at all, as you would expect. Now, I'm not sure how old this lock is, but the style came out in the late 1980s, and these weren't made for all that long. So this is probably somewhere in the neighborhood of 25 to 30 years old. Picking these is relatively easy once you understand the mechanism. What we need to do is put pressure on that sliding carriage, and then we can pick those dimple pins as we would in a normal lock. So to put that pressure on, I'm going to insert the back of this tension tool. Okay, I think I have that about right. And I'm going to use this normal lock pick to feel each of those dimple pins. Okay, the first one's loose. The second one is binding very tightly. Got a nice click out of him. A little click on the third, and I just touched the fourth, and it popped right open. So, not too hard to pick, but certainly an interesting lock. In any case, that's all I have for you today. Randy, thank you very much for sending it my way. To everyone else, if you do have any questions or comments, please put them below. If you like this video and would like to see more like it, please subscribe. And as always, have a nice day. Thank you.